All right, hello. Uh, welcome to another video. Uh, this video is for um, uh, 507 Mitchell. Uh, he asked me to see what models I have and what condition or show what conditions they are. So start start off with the high grade GM ground GM. Uh, the only thing I've been doing to it is uh, or my models is just just detailing with uh, just marker. Haven't really added the decals or. Uh, Stickers on it yet. Uh, overall, there's the stickers, just the eyes and the cockpit right here. But that's all pretty much. Uh, stable. Uh, next one is uh, Space Command GM. So, uh, still no stickers on it, uh, just panel line. Next one is the the tall geese crystal clear version, high green. No stickers at all. No, no actual detail to it yet. Nah, I just since it's clear, I didn't really put any details to it. And then uh, I bought two of those model kits, so I made a Toggies 3 and Toggies 1. Nothing yet, uh, no details added to it. I haven't put the stickers at all. It's pretty stable though. Next one is the Zeta Gundam. Uh, this one is the one that transforms, but uh, I just keep it in robot mode. One of my earliest models, so it's not really that good. And my very first high grade one, Double Zeta. Uh, after starting in the other models, I went back to this one and uh, trimmed it a little, detailed it more. And of course, the master grade, uh, easy eight. No details, but uh, like other easy eight master grades, the hands pop out easy. The only thing wrong about this one is that I made a mistake right here. Then uh, this part was stuck, and I forgot to put another part for the hand where the ball, uh, where the ball joint goes. I forgot to put it in, and uh, this thing would not come off, so I had to cut it in half.
but overall, it, it, the model came out nice. Uh, I just detailed it with uh, some Gundam marker, panel lined it. Was able to fix the eye problems that uh, a lot of Easy 8s had, which uh, the eyes just went down and wouldn't fit, uh, wouldn't fit the mass. But detailed the crap out of this model with just marker. I didn't really add any stickers. All the models are complete for now. And uh, these models I've got pretty cheap because um, I went to GundamStore.com Gundam and uh, I was lucky to find sales on these guys, especially for the Toggies one, uh, which is about, I got it for about 8 bucks each. So since I get a good deal on that one, I bought the GMs. Alright, uh, thanks for um, watching, uh, special thanks for waiting for uh, me to upload this video, uh, 507 Metro, and hopefully this helps. Oh man, uh, the paint for uh, the kneecaps for GM started to smudge off, so I need to uh, repaint that one. And uh, overall, those are just the models I have, I uh, have not really bought any new ones. Uh, uh, haven't really collected Gundam that much yet uh, for a while, but uh, definitely got into Star Wars, especially the Beagle sets. And I just got this one in today. Alright, um, thanks for watching, guys.